All right. So last night there was a nice, uh, nice fight night type uh, style uh, boxing match between Vander and uh, Vitor Belfort, and um, I don't know. I just wanted to know everyone's thoughts of um, should they? Do you think they should still have this? Um, these older older men um, fighting like this. Um, I think what they should do is because this happened. I think the the age bracket, the age difference is extreme. I think they should have like if they're gonna fight older guys like this, which I don't know. You know, what do you think about it? What should they keep fighting people like this uh, this age? Um, I think they should. If they're gonna do it, they have to keep them fighting in their own bracket, within ten years at least. Within ten years, this this other guy, uh, Vitor Belfort, is so. It's quite a bit younger than um, Evander is. Also, would he? Do you think he would have done better against a different opponent? Maybe someone a little easier just to start him off. Um, do you think he's going to come back again? Who would he verse? Do you want to see him verse somebody again? I don't know. Personally, I think he should just um, put it, put down the the belt, you know. Just put it, put down his, uh, you know, just retire. That's it. I don't see him. Uh, the best I could see him doing right now is just doing little tune-ups. I, um, it, he didn't look as good as he should have. But also, he's fighting. I I don't know Vitor Belfort very well, but I feel like he, he showed up tonight and um, he looked good. He looked really good, even for someone at uh, age 44, I believe he looked good. Um, Vander, I don't think he landed any punches while I was watching this. Um, I don't think he landed anything, but. If he was fighting someone nearing 60 like he is, would he have um, been able to put up put a better number on him? Would he be able to touch him? Maybe um, just match up people closer in age. That's what I'm thinking. How do you guys feel about all this? Just let me know in the comments. This um, it was rough. Definitely from what I'm reading and from what I think, I think it was just a really rough watch. Um, the other fights in the card were pretty good. Um, Anderson did a great job. I, it's very rare you see any uh, boxer do this type of um, just just be able to do this. Not not extremely rare, but it's different the way he does it. I feel like um, a couple other guys have kind of replicated it, but not exact exactly how he did. I think he's got definitely got like an interesting uh, style that he's doing, but um, yeah, it was a it's just a rough watch last night. I'm, I think he should, um, Evander should probably retire, but uh, let's say he does fight. Who do you think would be appropriate? I, th I mean, even if you put him up against Mike, he, you know. It's probably more um, close in it. They're closer in age, so it makes more sense than putting someone, f you know, however many years younger against him. Um, I think they said De La Hoya was supposed to verse Belfort, but that was um, put off because of um, COVID. Um, do you think De La Hoya would have? If this is if this is true, I'm not a hundred percent. But do you think Del Hoya would have done the same? Would he have done better? I think he would have struggled too. I don't know uh, Del Hoya's exact age. I'm sure he's a little younger than Vander by quite a bit. But um, yeah, I'm sure Van um, Del Hoya would have struggled as well. Uh, you know, at this point, I'm sure even Mike would have uh, struggled. Maybe he would have done a little better, but the closest matchup I could see is probably just get this Evander and Tyson matchup going. Um, I don't even want to see that, personally. I don't think I want to see a third um, match between the two. It's, um, we already know who had, who was, you know, we've seen the styles. We saw who was winning in the last two. 
Um, shoot, I, if Mike wants it though, and if it, if they both want it, then they can get back in there. But it's really up to them. It's not nothing we could do. But what do you guys think? This is uh, definitely an interesting topic. I figured I'd talk about it a little bit and see what everyone else is thinking. This is, I got a, a boxing chat I'm in. So they're all constantly talking about um, all the the retired boxers coming back in. Um, and it's interesting to watch and read through all these forums and see what everyone else is saying about these boxers, how they you know, how they'd fight on to 50, 60, 60 plus, um, it's still crazy, certain fighters, um, uh, you know, they fought, even fighting past their 40s, insane to see them keep going and going, um, I just, I'm just hearing the other day, um, I heard something that Tommy Hearns was fighting in the early 2000s, early late 2000s I think early mid late but somewhere in the the 2000s I should say and um I was surprised cuz you know he's up in age um George Foreman you know 45 wins the title he's also was pretty up in age retires at I believe 48 49 something like that but um you know Bernard Hopkins all um uh, all up in age, but they're still, they were still willing to fight past that, so, you know, it's clear that they enjoy the sport, and, um, they want to keep it going, whether they're at it for, at it for money, or whatever they're at it for, um, they just want to keep the sport going, and that's always, that's, it's good to see, but it comes a time, you know, you gotta, um, get out of the sport for a little bit and uh, retire yeah it's definitely definitely good to see that they're still willing but it's hard to watch if they're getting um it's just hard to watch if they get beat up you know they gotta know their limits who they're versing how good is this person but uh anyways I'm gonna wrap it up here again thank you for watching and uh, enjoy the rest of your day. In the description, I have uh, my uh, Robinhood and my first trade links. If you want to create a first trade or Robinhood account, look into it a little bit, of course. I'm not a financial advisor, but uh, it'll give you a free, free stock. It'll give me a free stock. It helps us both out. Uh, again, just look into it. Um, be sure this is what you want to do if you do want to sign up. Use the link. Make sure you use the link to um, get the free stock as well. Thank you.